morning. Hold on. Let me turn this light off. That's much better. But I'm going to do something a little bit different this month. So if you see a whole lot more of me, don't be surprised. You're going to be like, oh, I'm sick of that bitch. Yeah, be sick, ho. Matter of fact, there's the trash can. Make sure you aim. Anywho, I'm up bright and early at the crack of fucking dawn because for some reason I passed out so early last night. Well, not for some reason because I was genuinely tired. My cute little... Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ring light that I got. I've been manifesting this. You're crooked. Do you see? Should, do I need to do warm? Is that... I don't know. But yeah, five fucking dollars. I should've got at least, I was saying at least two, so I could do from the side instead of like right on. Cause shout out to the man at the post office that took my passport photo and told me I had a shiny fucking forehead. I already knew, but yeah, okay. Was that supposed to unlock some sort of new insecurity? It's just the light. You see how the water rolls off? <laughs> see how the light just beams back? Like, yeah. It's a bit messy she's i promise i don't live like this for real i washed all my dishes last night so oh, you can't even see that's my stuff my cooking drawer and that little thing right there that pink thing is an impulse purchase from where was i yesterday where was i yesterday i don't really remember the day was a blur but I got this, I couldn't not get it. It was 50 cents and it's unicorn shaped. So in case you're new here, here are my credentials. It's a bit intimate showing you my bed sheets, but that's okay, we're, we're cool. So yeah, I just had to get that. I think it's like a, a ice mold or something like that. We'll find a good use for her. The actual reason I even went to this store was to find like a shoulder bag for school because a backpack, one, it's too hot to have two straps and something molded to the back of you. It's too hot for that. And to be walking, no. Two, I just don't feel like it's very ergonomic. Like I'm walking, I'm walking, I'm trying to get something off my back. I have to stop, turn around, be dramatic as fuck, put that bitch on like a baby and reach my hand into the front to get whatever I want for a split second. It's not worth it. So this cute handy dandy little satchel. <laughs> Whip that bitch open, hold on. Actually it's clipped because safety first. Unclip it, whip that bitch open. Oh, so spacious, so ludicrously capacious. I already have a little laptop bag that's cute and pink and pretty, but it didn't fit my laptop. It's a laptop bag that couldn't fit my laptop. It was a birthday party with a birthday gift at the birthday party. I can't wait till I get some more like bag accessories and stuff. I don't wanna do it like too much with the charms cause I don't need you to hear me coming from a mile away, but she needs to be cute and recognizable from a distance. Be like, oh, you're so chic, I love you. And then it also doubles as a form of protection. If anyone tries to run up on me, I can just swing it at them. <laughs> you can't do that with the backpack. And since I'm in a crazy little cleaning mood, one thing I'm gonna get done today, hold on. One thing I'm gonna get done today is trying on all my clothes and throwing away everything I absolutely would not be caught outside in because the way things work around here, Someone could pull the fucking fire alarm in the middle of the night and if you're you're like ass naked or your pajamas have a fucking hole in them, you're ass out. Your ass is hanging out in the middle of the parking lot. So <laughs> I've also watched some girl on TikTok saying like, there's no point in having clothes that you would not wear outside. There's no point. You've got the random bleach stain, you've got the random rip here and there. So they're getting executed. And the, only the baddies are making the cut. You start from scratch, it doesn't really fucking matter. I'm just probably gonna be wearing the same thing for two weeks <laughs> until I build my wardrobe back up. But that's okay. I can beat I can beat the outfit repeater allegations. My name is Lizzie McGuire and I don't give a damn. I don't even usually use Tide, but this is the cutest, tiniest little teensy bubble of Tide. This is not more productive than buying a full size product. I just think it's cute. We're just gonna um I was about to say, I don't know where a good place for my vision board would be when I turn on the camera. Like, I don't want to just be in the background and shit. Because, like I said, 
I don't believe that's something that should be on the internet. I mean, you can show it after the fact, but this is my, this is still in action. We're currently checking things off the board. I don't need, I don't need any interference from hating ass hoes on the internet, okay? Not that a bitch could ever block my blessing what's meant for me. I think I'm gonna put a curtain right here, like a sheer something I could slide back, be dramatic and like unveil, you know, like surprise, shoddy. Come a little closer, cause I need to show you. Oh, her dress is cute. Recording strangers is weird, you can't do that. Even if they look good, you know, that doesn't give you permission to fucking whip your phone out and record me, ho. Like, why are you, why are you being weird right now? But then again, some people will say like, oh, that's how Alex from Target got famous. That could change people's lives. What if I wanted to be a nobody in the middle of Wisconsin and now I'm being flown out to be on the cover of Vogue just because you were horny and thought I was hot? Think about the implications of your actions. This is the closet. This is me. She's cool, she's calm. On this side. Oh my God. Yeah, yeah, you see what I mean? Also, we're gonna talk about Bruno. I've dropped her, she's been through, been with Bae through thick and thin. She's already thick, so she'd have to adapt that. that song just popped in my head for some reason, but I've dropped this, bopped it, twisted it, put it in the dryer, some more stuff. As you can tell, I have a bright red fryer truck Chick-fil-A straw. It's not that I don't know where it is, it's that I'm definitely afraid of not cleaning it all the way and still drinking mold, so I just put disposable straws in there. Stanley who? This is my yell nap. This is my yell nap. I love my yell nap. If you don't get that reference, I need you to go back in time, watch Holes, and then come back so you can laugh with me. We can laugh together. Stanley Yelnap is low-key and iconic. It's not even low-key and iconic name. I don't know why they would bully you for having that kind of name. I would think you're the coolest kid. Like, your parents did mental gymnastics and they thought 10 steps ahead. What do you mean? It's a tradition. You're cool as fuck. It's like being bullied for being ugly. You're mad because they're hard to look at, it doesn't make much sense. And if anyone has a better system for organizing this shelf in particular, let me know, sound off down below, because I did consider getting like a Lazy Susan type organizer that spins, but I don't know if the products would fit on top of like a platform and still be functional without touching the top of this. So I have to do some major mechanic measuring I'm not a woman in STEM, but we can figure it out for sure. I'm gonna moisturize my lips. They didn't chat this whole video. I don't care. <laughs> shoulder up, put the shoulder up, and drop. two weeks which if I want this video up today I've got to put my ass to the grass and scoop is that the first time everyone anyone's ever put those words together perhaps not but I am about to sit down and do what I said I would been working for about 30 minutes but my stomach is touching my back because I haven't eaten yet I just thought I'd take a break to show you guys how I finesse my food in my room if you're a snitch go ahead and x out right now because i do not need you calling carl bismarck on me this is just a little bit illegal but you gotta do what you gotta do right this is my kitchen what's up mtv i'm kim kardashian and welcome to my home this is the kitchen there's usually a lot of fucking people here but it's usually where i plug up my ah contraband you better run down to Target and go get you one of these. It's a chicken salad. I'm really glad I don't have any enemies because I like to do stuff in broad daylight with my window wide fucking open. Anyone can walk by and like take a picture of me doing what I'm not supposed to be doing. If you really hated my guts, all you gotta do is show it to my RA. Be like, 
Do you know? Did you know? Is this your bitch? I guess but is my filler word of the day too. I usually say and, if, so, but now it's but. <laughs> These are my girls. I don't know if I've talked about my food obsession already. It's Winco Everything Bagels. <clears throat> they dropped me off in the middle of a fucking island and were like, here bitch, fend for yourself. And I only had one recipe in my brain, I wouldn't be mad if it was that bagel. I always say I'd hate to be stuck on a coconut island because I don't really like coconuts, context or not. I'd rather be stuck on like a banana island or a pineapple island. But honey is essential to the recipe. It's very simple, three ingredients. I don't do, you see how I keep it cute, keep it simple, stick to three ingredients. I don't do the most like a lot of you bitches in the morning. The last of my cream cheese too, so. I don't know what's the shelf life on chia seeds. I got these two days ago. I got them on a Friday. It's currently a sun. What's going on here? It's a big swarm of palm colored people. Off topic. I don't know how long chia seeds last because if they start sprouting, I will resign. I will formally resign. I've also d developed another irrational fear. Have y'all seen Adventure Time and Finn has that like fucking flower sprout out of his arm? So it turns out that happens to real people in real life. Like you can have plants start growing out of places and shit. I don't know the science behind it. I'm no STEM major. I just think that's scary as fuck. How gnarly do your toenails have to get for you to start sprouting like seeds? <laughs> it's just nasty thinking about like people who have a mile long ingrown hair. How do you not like pick at that a little bit? You let it grow there for 20 years. That's crazy. If you have like a texture problem or tripophobia, is that what it's called? Don't fucking, this is not the food for you. You might die on sight. Come closer. I'm gonna pop a squat real quick so that we can get close and personal, but I've been doing this little TikTok bagel hack, but this, this is better than, um, this is better than slicing it in half, and this is why. Every bite has a little bit of seeds. There's cream cheese in between, so it's like the ratio is good. And then the top is nice and crusty and caramelized. I do a little bit of honey too, so it gives it a nice little <clears throat> We do this every day, bro. It's every day, bro, with the Disney Channel flow. It's not fake. I need probably a spoon. I forgot that TikTok was supposed to be being banned. And like, I don't feel like people are panicking about it as much anymore. You know how many people you probably talk to and they're like, oh, I heard. Somebody told me. I read somewhere. Don't be shy, Stink. You saw a fucking TikTok. What's the shame in saying, I saw it in a TikTok. I saw it on TikTok. Why do you have to like, act like it's a level five academic source? Yeah. A little dab of honey the final dab i am so glad that hot ones has like um wing alternatives because yeah i want to see the vegans on the show too i feel like that would be one of my dream shows to go on hot ones and rupaul's drag race i'd love to be a judge on rupaul's drag race i hate 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 your hair and makeup today <laughs> Yeah, this thing is low-key kind of loud. It sounds like I'm starting a small engine in here, but, or a small fighter plane. But yeah, that was good television marketing. They cut her, they cut and spliced that clip so good. They're like, Nicki Minaj, Nicki Minaj is the villain. She's the bad guy, Chun-Li. That would have been everything with some bangs. I miss my bangs. Yeah, put the hands on the knees, Angelina Jolie. Yesterday, my breakfast looked so cute. Now that the camera's on, I think it's gonna look a little crusty and crazy. Oh. Circling back to what I said about the chia seeds earlier, one rational fear that I have is them sprouting in my sink because I keep rinsing them down my sink. So in a couple weeks, if I have like little chia sprouts in my sink, I wouldn't be surprised. Here's everything I stole from the school cafeteria. Soy milk, orange juice, chia seeds, some different desserts in here that's birthday cake carrot cake it's like a blueberry muffin and that little pastry was nasty i shouldn't have sold that i've got a bunch of toppings for my hamburgers a bunch of greens and what is this tomatoes pico de gallo and onions i guess i didn't steal as much as i thought hmm. 
and this is the breakfast yeah with a nice tall glass of water <clears throat> i usually eat after the gym but the gym doesn't open until 12 o'clock today so i gotta feed myself back to editing though back to our regularly scheduled programming Whatever weapons are being formed against me right now shall not fucking prosper, okay? So cut it out. I feel like making my edits more simple is going to help me produce more content, like consistently, you know? Instead of taking 10 hours to edit one piece of content. What if it only took me one hour? <laughs> one hour is like crazy, but two hours instead of 10. Then you get five videos instead of one. Is that how math works? Yeah, but you've watched me edit long enough. I'm gonna try to hurry up and get this done so I can get it posted. Well, not even, it can go up later today, but I just want it to be done so I can go to the gym and work out and finally take a shower and get on with my day. I've been sitting here waiting for the gym to open. The world don't start till I do my workout, so. I like Sundays though. Take it easy. Take it easy, baby. Middle of summer, I'm freezing, baby. So, <laughs> I'm awfully comfortable, but the rough cut of my video is exporting if you can't see that tiny little black screen in the background but i'm about to brush my hair and put some clothes on so i can go to the gym it's only all i've been talking about all day it's 11 33 so i still have 30 minutes but it's probably going to take about 30 minutes for this video to export mm -hmm. yeah and then when i come back from the, or while i'm at the gym i guess uh i could work on I kind of already know what I want for the thumbnail, but if I want to be bring be extra and bring my iPad, I could edit my thumbnail on the the fucking stairmaster. Cause have y'all seen the girl on TikTok that sings Megan the Stallion and sweats on the stairmaster? She is my inspiration in life. Like one time, a boy told me I looked really good sweating on the stairmaster. Which, why are you watching me in the gym? I mean, I guess. I can be somebody's gym crush, but I guess like me watching her, if that's how he felt about me, I get it. I get it, cause I swear to God, I'm gonna insert her video. She like, she makes me get up and get on the fucking stairmaster. She said, "Your excuse is giving somebody else permission to do it," or however the fuck she said it. But it made me get out of bed, get off my ass, and get on my fucking Zoom. All I'm gonna say is your excuses just gave someone else the opportunity. Mm -hmm, maybe run that one back just trying to figure out this um video but my earring just fell out of this ear and now i'm trying to put it in this ear because i haven't had an earring over here forever and just as i suspected i think the hole might be closed so ooh, that's gonna be sore that's gonna be sore for a little bit this earring back was so crusty it wasn't stinky don't get it twisted but it was very crusty I'm fixing my hair so I can go rip and run around the city, but I don't know if you can see in the background My video is my final cut is finally <laughs> Is that why that app is called Final Cut Pro? Anyway <laughs> It's finally exporting and after that I'm gonna upload it so um, Pretty successful day if I do say so myself I sat in this room and did one task and for someone like me psh, round of fucking applause But yeah, I'm considering going out tonight i don't know i don't know i feel like i want to ask my friend if she wants to go out i gotta ask myself first do i want to go out <clears throat> i'll let you know just wanted to pop in i feel like i haven't that lighting was horrible i feel like i haven't said anything in a while so yeah you like my gaming setup like i said i'm still working on that but she's functional right now i'm about to taste test this carrot cake real quick um, I got the new crumble cookie, Olivia Rodrigo. I actually do have a crumble story time. It's not anything crazy, but that little boy had a crush on me and gave me a free cookie. God is good. Cheers. The carrot cake is very good. The carrot cake is scrumptious, dare I say. Mm. That's my cue some not so exciting news chat earlier i was contemplating going out but that's no longer an option because i just took two motrin and washed it down with some coca-cola because i feel awful it could be because i was just talking about how i was the pinnacle of health two days ago so 
God decided to strike me down and show me a thing or two. I think this is the last time I'll see you in this video. I don't have anything else going on tonight. Um, probably just cry myself to sleep because I feel fucking awful. And edit. Thanks for spending the day with me. If you had fun, um, thank you. Love you lots. I'll see you tomorrow. And if you didn't have fun, there's the door. I'm just laying in bed watching Juno because Sabrina Carpenter won't shut up about it. But I do have some opinions for this about this movie. We're gonna save them for tomorrow. So good night, kitty girls. Oh, camera's over here. <laughs> my bad. Hugs, kisses, XOXO. No bonnet on my head but i'm determined to get through this movie so that's my motivation good night